in this lesson we are going to learn glycerol and glycerin let's try let's write a compound propane this is propane when three hydrogen atoms from these three carbon atoms are replaced by three hydroxyl groups then we get this compound now let's try to name this compound first of all the carbon atoms are numbered 1 2 3 now its name is 1 2 3 trihydroxy propane this compound is considered as derivative of this compound that is why its name is 1 2 3 trihydroxypropane or we can write propane 1 2 3 triol since it is a kind of alcohol that is why all triol this compound is a bit sweet in taste a greek word glycaros meaning is sweet from this word this compound sometimes called glycerol and at times it is called glycerin actually glycerol and glycerin are used open interchangeably nevertheless let's try to find a slight difference between them difference between glycerol and glycerin glycerol PO form of 1 to 3 trihydroxypropane that means when this is in PO form then it is called glycerol now let's see glycerin 95% this compound that means 1 2 3 trihydroxypropane and it contains 5% water mainly it might contain additionally perfume or fragrance that means glycerin is slightly diluted form of glycerol one more point that is glycerin is spelling this is of British English and this is of American English this is about glycerol and glycerin thank you very much